Well, even if it's too hot to go outside, you can have some fun and stay inside because Simone Boyce has been working on something huge this summer, her show, Simone in the City debuts this Saturday. Simone's here to give us a first look. Simone, I've been listening to you edit, and it's been so exciting. I can't wait to see it. Oh, the whole process has been amazing. And I keep saying this to everyone when they want to know what the show is about. It's really my love letter to New York City. It's a beautiful city. It's a surprising city. It's a challenging city. So over the next four weeks, I'm taking viewers on this great adventure, and we're going to be experiencing all of those things. So mm, starting with this weekend, we're leaving the hustle and bustle behind, and we're hitting the beach. Here's a little taste of the new and improved Coney Island. If you think you've seen everything there is to see in Coney Island, maybe it's time to take a closer look. <laughs> this is Coney Art Walls, right in the heart of Coney Island. Here there are over 30 walls, beautiful paintings that really capture the flavor of New York City. You could spend hours here just walking through this maze of murals. Today I'm hanging out with two of the artists who painted some of these amazing walls. Cheers. Cheers. So what do you call this? This is Hercules at the crossroads. We see Hercules in the middle, he's about to make his choice, you know, he's, he's looking this way, going to a, a side of virtue and, and a good life, which is also a sweet life. I always paint ice cream characters. You know, for me, ice cream is a, is a nice kind of symbol for life, you know, it's, it's uh, we got limited time here, you know, for sure, you can easily melt away. Uh, but I think, I think, especially in the context of Coney Island and ice cream, we have ice cream vendors. It's hot summer, of course. I mean, I think it, it really plays into what's going on down here. Local New Yorkers who wouldn't normally come down to Coney Island want to come down and see this. Caves is a native from Bay Ridge, Brooklyn. You know, I'm a Brooklyn boy, so summertime, uh, Brooklyn night, you know, uh, bring it back, reminisce, a little nostalgia. I wanted to give like a little Brooklyn history inside of the mural. So the textures that are coming out with all the names yeah. is actually celebrities that are born and raised in Brooklyn. And the, the title of the wall is Brooklyn Made. This, this block would be a block that we hung out on and played stickball and, uh, you know, hung out on the stoop and, and dreamed big about one day making it big. At the end of the day, we represent for one neighbor, and that's Brooklyn. Cheese! Nathan's is a Coney Island institution, but now there are a few more options for grub around here, and that's thanks to Smorgasburg. Smorgasburg is the famous outdoor food market, popular in Brooklyn, Queens. Well, now there's location right here, right in the middle of the Coney Art Wall. Looking good. Caves, where do we start? Yeah, um, it looks delicious. This is great. Like, you look at all the different foods, the different backgrounds. It's like, it's true to the burrow, like one big melting pot. Mm -hmm. It's right here in this little yard, you know? <laughs> it's really amazing, because now a whole new generation has another reason to go see Coney Island, because of those really incredible art walls and the great awesome. food. So we've got a ton of cool stuff planned and I'm doing stuff that I've never done before on this show. I'm doing stand-up comedy, which was absolutely I can't terrifying. Wait. I, you How'd know you what do? happened to me the other night? What? My, my dog walker texts me and he's like, he was at I the Gotham him. Comedy Club. Yes. And he's a comedian. <laughs> yes. And he was like, um, Simone Boyce, somebody, you know, just got off stage. I was like, what are you talking yeah. about? <laughs> Did he give you a review? What did he say? Did he well, say she we'll was funny? Save it. We'll save it yeah, for, we'll save it. for that episode. <laughs> I was like, what? I know, I'm doing That's crazy amazing. stuff. Yeah, I just I just want to push myself and get outside my comfort zone and hopefully encourage people at watching at home to pursue something they've always wanted to do. Perfect, what New York's all about. I've Thanks. always wanted to try that. That's the scariest thing in the whole world. It's the most Getting terrifying thing. Getting up and telling thing. jokes. Oh. Those people are genius. It was it's worth scary. it, though. Oh, good. All right, can't wait to show you guys everything we have planned. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, Simone. And again, you can catch Simone's new show, Simone in the City, Saturdays at 10 a.m. and 7 p.m. It all starts this Saturday, August 1st, right here on Fox 5.